Hi everyone, it's Samantha from Awesome Hair and Nails, and today I'm going to be showing you all how to do the perfect bun, and also I have some news. The news is that now in the description box below, you can find out what I'm wearing for the video, um, all the videos from now on, it, because a lot of you guys have been asking me that, and now let's get on to the supplies you will need for the perfect bun. Okay, so the first thing you will need for the perfect bun is a comb or a brush. A donut, I got mine at Claire's. One hair elastic that matches your hair color, and you will need two hair elastics that don't match your hair color. You will need, I today I'm just using these little twisty things that I got from Walgreens, and they only cost $8, but they are the perfect thing for buns, because all you have to do is you just have to screw them in, and they work perfectly. And they work better than bobby pins, but if you'd like, you can also use bobby pins. And you can actually use both if you'd like. But today, I'm just going to be using um, these little twisty things. And possibly, maybe, one bobby pin. Some optional supplies is a bow or two. So get your supplies ready and get ready for step one. Okay, so with the two hair elastics that don't match your hair color, you want to tie your hair in a ponytail with them. And then after, you just want to get your comb or your brush, and you just want to comb out all the hair that's in your ponytail and make sure it's all straight. I would suggest to start combing from the back because the back always has more tangles. So then after you've done that, you can just tighten up your um, ponytail, and then you want to get your donut. And I just like to get my thumb and my pointer finger and I just stick them through the, the middle of the donut and just pull all that hair that's in the ponytail through. Then after you've done that, I'm just going to tilt my head and make sure all your hair is covering the donut because you don't want anyone to see the donut. Because you want it to look like you did it without a donut. So just kind of fidget with it until... You got it, and probably, if you can't do it, see if someone else can do it for you, but sometimes it's pretty kind of easy to do it if your hair is kind of thick, but if your hair is like mine, kind of fine, um, you might have a problem with it, but sometimes you don't. Like, I don't, I barely have a problem with it. Sometimes I do, but sometimes I don't. Okay, so then once you've done that, you want to you just get your hair elastic that matches your hair color. And you just want to pull it over the donut. And now you don't see the donut anymore. So then after that, I look kind of funny. So then after that, you have all this beautiful, gorgeous hair down. And then after that, you have an option. You can just braid all this hair. You can rope braid it. You can fishtail braid it. Or you can twist it. I'm going to just twist it because it looks a little bit more natural than braiding it, twisting it, or rope, or braiding it, or whatever you want to do. So if you're going to twist it like me, you just want to twist and add. 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 Twist and add, 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 and just continue that until you can't go no more. Okay, so now once you're at the ends of your hair, I just have a little bit left. You just want to get the your little twisty thing, and you're just going to stick it through your hair. And it's kind of hard, but if you get it um, under the donut, it, it's not as hard, okay? So after you just got that in, you might have a little bit of hair left, and you don't want to let it go, 
because then all the hard work you put into it just gonna give up. So now I'm just going to take my other one and I'm just going to do the ends. Okay. Okay, so then after I've done that, you can add... Okay, so it stood, and this is how that looks. Now, if you'd like, you can add a bow, and... But that's optional, and that's all we have today. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye!